Hello and welcome everyone to this auction video for this Citroen DS3. I'm going to give you a quick walk around of this as I don't have much time today. It's a 14 plate Citroen DS3 with 105,000 miles. This one has got a full service history and uh, drives very well. It's got a few little marks on the wheels but the body works looking really nice and clean and tidy and a nice solid car and uh, yeah a, a nice little car. So anyway let me give you a quick walk around and we'll see whatever damage we can see. We've got a little scratch here on the mirror. Front end's looking good. No uh, major damage jumping out at me. Probably a few stone chips and light, I think there's like a light scratch down there on the bottom. Uh, headlights are looking nice as well. Fog lights are working. They're all looking good. Bonnets looking good. There's one or two stone chips there. Maybe a bit of dirt as well. Uh, it's had a quick wash in our wash bay, but um, could benefit from more cleaning. I'll always again a bit marked up, mirror marked up, a little bit of rust there under the mirror. Passenger door otherwise looking nice. Your usual wear and tear marks down the opening of the door, around the door handle. This rear panel is looking good. Uh, slight little dent there on the arch, nothing much. Rear lights are looking good. Both lights are looking good. A little bit of scratches here and there, but nothing really heavy. The back end's looking good. No structural damage again jumping out at me. Just a little dent here on the uh, boot and your usual wear and tear marks around the opening of the rear door. Coming around to this rear panel again, alloys got some scratch scratches. Taking close up photos of each of these alloys and tire tre de tread depths, and there's not a lot of depth left on these tires. Uh, usual marks on the opening of the door, around the door handle. The actual door not looking too bad at all. A little chip there. As I say, mirror's got a little scratch. Let's have a quick look around the inside. Let's get the boot up. Boot comes up, operates no problem. Supports its weight. We've got the uh, partial shelf there. Boot's looking okay. And we've got an inflation kit there in the back. Let's have a look on the inside of the vehicle up front here. So no problem with the operation of the door. We've got electric windows. I think we've got electric mirrors as well. Yeah, I'm not testing the mirrors. I'll test those in a sec. Interior is looking good. Uh, a little bit grubby here and there. It could benefit from more cleaning, as I said. It's had a wash in our wash bay. This camera is actually making it look a lot worse than it is. It's not that bad, I would say, in person. But yeah, a little bit more cleaning and you've got a real nice tidy car. Coming right to the driver's side again, no problem with the operation of the door. Let's just check these mirrors. So we've got a switch miss missing here, but it does still operate both of the uh, electric mirrors and they're both working, so that's good news. Right, and again, as I say, back of the seats just require, and the carpets require a bit of a clean. But on from that, it's a nice tidy car. Consider it's done 105,000 miles. Driver's seat is actually in very good condition, just needs a bit of a clean up. Uh, what else can we look at? Right, let's hop in. We will get all these lights off. So the headlights off, handbrake off, and we're just left with the fuel light and seatbelt light. No warning lights, so the same mileage there. That was 106,322 miles. Let's switch that off a sec. So we've got two keys. The main key is looking a little bit tired, but it still works on the remote. And we also have a manual key. I've not tried the, the manual key itself without all the remote bits on, but that also starts it up. And check for any warning lights. No warning lights, apart from saying the fuel level is too low. So yeah, as per usual, these trade cars, they're always super low with the, on the on the fuel side so otherwise all looking good we've got a pioneer radio and otherwise yeah not looking too bad in here at all nothing a little cleanup will sort out let's have a look at this service history i've taken photos of everything so please do check the auction listing for all the photos so we've got a stamp here 2015 16 17 18 19 and 20 21 and it jumps to 23 so we're kind of missing one there one mid 21 and one early 23 so kind of due a service next month 
and kind of ish missioner missing a service but i'm still going to call it a full service history because it has so many stamps there from new and uh yeah we got a couple of invoices there for servicing done in 2017 and um, that's a wheel balance i haven't really actually seen that 2018 i thought it was another service invoice so just one service invoice there from 2019 so that pretty much rounds it up let's have a look under the bonnet oh the other thing that there is is a there is a crack in the windscreen so a uh, stone's hit here and the crack is going straight to a quarter of the way of the windscreen so please be aware of that um let's have a look Let's get the bonnet up and have a look underneath the bonnet. There we go. So, no nasty knocks or rattles, no oily smells. I'll be quiet, let you have a look and listen. So there we have it guys, a rather nice Citroen DS3. 106,000 miles, 14 plate, very nice drive, virtual full service history, nice tidy car. Thanks for watching and happy bidding.